I'm Naomi Kramer. I'm a, I'm a painter and a video artist. Uh, and uh, sometimes, well, since uh, 2008, I've been combining painting and video uh, in what I call hybrid paintings, uh, which are oil on canvas paintings on which I project video. So the project I'm working on right now uh, is an opera uh, based on The Secret Garden, which is a well-loved children's story. Uh, it's a, a world premiere piece, a co-production of Cal Performances and the San Francisco Opera. So the story begins in India, and uh, it's about a very unhappy, maladjusted little girl whose parents uh, die in a cholera epidemic. She uh, is taken to England, to Yorkshire, to live with her uncle. Uh, and uh, there is a secret garden that she becomes aware of, and uh, that her, her contact with that gradually transforms her into a different person. So uh, this is the scene when uh, Mary first uh, arrives in, uh, in England and she takes the train to Yorkshire with uh, Mrs. Medlock, who is uh, the main housekeeper at Yorkshire. So this is uh, footage I shot actually in Yorkshire um, and uh, the train windows uh, obviously are uh, a mask that uh, deletes all the content except what you see through the window. I, I didn't actually make any paintings specifically for the Secret Garden, but what I did is shot uh, terabytes of footage uh, or in my, for the last year, everywhere I went, and I travel a fair bit, so uh, I have bits of footage, and you know, I was looking for moving leaves, moving, you know, bushes, and obviously, uh, you know, I always wanted the effect of the wind, because otherwise it just looks like a still. So it's a predominantly video-based set, which is uh, kind of an unusual thing, I think, and, and that's also uh, been very interesting. So this is one of the storyboards from The Secret Garden, and there are uh, many, many layers of video in each scene. So, for example, this scene has probably 10 layers of video footage that are all edited together and layered in order to create this final atmospheric piece. The original garden footage, which I shot in the spring, uh, but then uh, through Photoshop and masking and various uh, and desaturating, turned it into a much more a wintry image. Uh, some of the hedges in uh, in the piece, I uh, select and outline uh, the ones that I want to include in the video, and uh, just uh, edit that together into the final piece. Uh, so these are other hedges that are used, this, uh, and then uh, there's a painting that's uh, actually supplying a lot of the variation and the, the detail in the garden uh, that obviously doesn't look like it has a painting in it, but it's one of the layers that uh, creates the complexity and the richness. This is one of my paintings. Uh, and finally, there is um, the moving mist. It was actually uh, shadows on grass that I um, blurred and then uh, took the color out and enlarged to create this very, very subtle moving lighting effect. So this is what you're seeing is all those layers put together. I mean, one of the things that amazed me when I started to work with performance is how much effort goes into just a few performances, you know, because at least you spend months making a painting and you have a painting at the end of it. But performance is just ephemeral and unbelievable amount of effort goes into it. But, um, but there's a magic to it. First of all, uh, just the fact that it is performance and it's live, but also um, uh, the fact that it's huge, you know, so, and I've always loved to work big. So to have my stuff up huge is just thrilling. So. <laughs>